Davik says you missed your last payment. Here, I've oh, I'm not got good. 50 credits, a down payment. That should buy me some time, right? Sorry, you're out of time. Now it's all or nothing. Davik can't have people not paying his debts. But I don't have that um, much. Excuse me. How can I give you credits I don't have? No, help! Somebody help! They're going to kill me! I know you have to be careful about drawing attention to yourself. Are we gonna just let them drag this guy off? Hold on a mm, second. No. Looks like we got ourselves a witness. Oh, uh. Mm -hmm. Leave this man alone or you have to deal with him. I type one thing. Thank you. I owe you my life. Those bounty hunters are going to take me away and kill me. My wife warned me not to take a loan from Tavik. Now I can't pay him back. It's not good to owe a crime lord money. You just keep sending more bounty hunters after me till I'm dead. How much? How much do you owe? You already helped me by saving me from those bounty hunters, so unless you have a spare 100 credits to give me so I can pay off Davik, there's nothing else you can do. Uh. I guess I don't have that many credits. I'll. I'm getting out of here before any more of Davik's goons show up. You should do the same. Oh boy. Hey, Mom. What are you? Hang on, wait, they... Now I do, uh... He, he could've just... He could've just taken those bounty hunters credits and... Used that to pay him off. Nishi la chorga kin kun pala mona reji ching pala niska mule or tun rata tigin pot drunko the search at doma wana konda tama we team em bon rank thong mule ra on shaturing um ni patoga wanga chan zi te ika krotu haku jije watu yama kama wuna henak neck such racist what do they have again since kipuna bona na kichu Kin ba mule radwana, don kin ba no kunok neck. Kava numpa kun pialia monokata, ranga kun bis kin no moruat, kakin chana guana bokon. You'd think people would be a little more tolerant of others in this day and age. <laughs> I guess stupidity and ignorance will never go out of style. Genchopa chawi ti chok twis yun kun, watu yama kama wuna henak neck. Bugra shak kun ti chi wa um chawa, don abuk shami no no. China pala mule, tonki ba non tontek, tuni cha chon kun ne mule brabast. Yeah, I, I wondered why all of the exotic dances you see in Star Wars are Twilix. Me, the conclusion I came to, Twilix are seen as the sexiest aliens in the Star Wars galaxy. <laughs> what have you got to say? Shan Om Nong. Wanga kun bis kin ba mula ra choni yun tun jiji ida dwana kava vulpa muji gumana kakin cha na kwat na bon kon wana kun bes chi pala mulek tong ki pa na nonek tu nik ton chun chun ki nemolek ra best uf mala ni bokurk well i'll take the one that's on sale. We team and bone rank thong. Muli ra on shaturing um ni patoga wanga chon zi te. Ika krotu haku jije. Watu yama kama wuna henak neck. Which one is mine now? And that's the one that one's for sale, right? Wait. Hey, which one was mine? Oh, that, that sounds nasty. Well, since it's 
this on this top line one, I guess in it. Ooh. Randi e chawa tongbola Johnny Ku Yuma Wama Nibo Lora Waisha Waga Shichi. Boo up. I came to get my money back. Chawi, tichok twis yun kun. Watu yama kama wuna henak neck. Bugra shak kun tichi wa um chawa. Dong abuk shami no nok. Kakin cha na guat na bon kon. Wana kumbes. Chi pala mulek. Tong ki pa na no neck. Tu nik ton chun chun ki nemolek rabest. Wuf mala nibo kurk. Oh, he said money back guaranteed. Did you? All the trouble that wasn't really any trouble at all, I bought something, it was defective, so refund. No hot feelings. And no, I guess I'll be going. This elevator is off limits. Only Sith patrols and those with proper authorization are allowed into the lower city. It's obvious from the way you're dressed oh? that you're not one of the Sith patrols. So unless you have the authorization papers, you must move along. Oh. Where can I get these authorization papers? If you were supposed to have them, you'd know where to get them. Now quit wasting my time and move along. What? Just move Hang on along. here. There's nothing to see here. Where did you hide those Sith oh. uniforms? Did you sell them to the Dominion oh. Underground? Start talking. I want <laughs> answers. He offered to. He it out. And Raji good. And he behind all of the earth. And now for the Dufta. Gloria. Sith uniforms, huh? You're a little too curious for your own good, civilian. This doesn't concern you. I know all about Sith interrogations. This isn't going to end well. I'm getting sick of your oh, lies, yeah. you alien scum. We've got your ugly mug and a security tape from the base. Start talking before I splatter your slimy brains all over this room. Uh-oh. Oh, the command is losing his temper. I'm glad I'm out of here. It took me an hour to clean the bloodstains from my uniform after the last interrogation. Maybe you could... Wait, maybe the alien really Just doesn't know anything. You know what's good for you. Hmm. Well, I'll take a risk. Hear you right? Let us kill him. How can you stop us? Time to teach the civilian the penalty for defying the Sith. Well, definitely attack. Wait. Oh. Haha. <laughs> Oh, there's more.
Mm-hmm. Under. Hey, Sean, Dano. Well, he. He left and he left this behind, so. Obviously, not too much value to him. How do you do, fellow Sif? patrol heading down to the lower city, eh? Well, good luck. I heard it's pretty rough down there. There's a big swoop gang war going on, you know. You better watch yourself. Those gangs will take a shot at anyone, even us. It's too bad we don't have the manpower just to sweep those slums clean. Mm-hmm. I think I can take this skies off now. No one being mistaken for an actual Sif. Oh. Huh? So there's the gang walls I was mentioned. Whoa! Oh! Kibona! Kavatumpa Kupa Yamoka Pata! Okay! Hmm. <laughs> What's going on here? Go away. She's got need you. Kimba Muli Rab on a G. Kimba no kum mixa trabon. Kakinja nawa bagaon. Dun abashun ni chunchi. Kipona. Kava tumpa kupa yiya moka paata. Chiyoka kutumpa kulpa yiya. One. Oscar. I think you're in trouble. Kipuna, <laughs> Doom a big game. Three. Hmm? Oh. No. No. <laughs> no. Not bad. Hello. No way. Oh. <laughs> I saw you have mopped up those black focus. Nice work. One. Okay, 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 I'm going. Smart. Fine, I get it. I'll leave you alone. Hey, you can't just walk in here. This is the hidden back base. How do I know you're not a Volker spy sent to kill Gadon Thek? Hmm. Hey, Gadon's help. I was told to speak to him. A lot of people want to go inside and speak to Gadon. He's a hero of the common folk. But the days of the Hidden Beck's open door policy are gone. Between the no. Sith conquest and the Valkyr gang war, Gadon has more enemies than he used to. We're being careful about who we let in now. Maybe I could help you out? Well, we do need all the help we can get. And you don't look like you're with the Valkyrs or the Sith. Besides, it's not like you can do anything to harm Gadon in the heart of his own base. Not with Zedra watching his back. So you going to let me in? Go in and speak to Gadon if you want. Just remember to be on your best behavior. The hidden Bex are watching you. So you... Hold it right there. Who uh... are you? And what is your business with Gadon? Calm down, Zerdra. Nobody's going to try anything here in the middle of our own base. It would be a suicide mission. You're too mm. trusting, Gadon. Brezhik and his Valkyrs want you dead. Anyone we don't know is a potential threat, and it's my job to make sure you're safe. Do you want us to start attacking strangers on site, Zerdra? Like the Vulcans do? Hmm. I will never let it come to that. Now step aside and let them pass. As you yeah, wish. You can speak to Gadden if you want, but I've got my eye on you. You try anything and you'll be vaporized before you can say Vulcar spy. Okay, okay. You'll have to forgive Zerdra. 
Ever since Bredjik and the Vulkers began this war against us, she's been a little overzealous in her security duties. The problems with the Sith haven't helped things. Zerdra seems to forget that I know how to look after myself. Now, how can I help you? I need information on those probably escape pods that crashed in the Undercity. The escape pods? You know, I heard the Sith have been asking around the Upper City about them as well. But you don't look like you're with the Sith. They might be spies, yeah, and I took my They might be working off. for the Sith. Calm down, Zerdra. If the Sith thought we knew anything useful, they'd have a battalion of troops kicking down our door. No, I think this offworlder has her own agenda. Oh boy, I'm not working for the Sith. I suppose I could tell you what I know. It's not like it could do any harm to me or my gang. But it might cause problems for the Vulkas. And that's okay in my book. The Vulcans <laughs> stripped those pods clean within hours after they left. Oh. It's too bad we didn't get there first, considering what my spies reported the Vulcans found. A female Republic officer named Bastila survived the crash. We Bex uh -huh. don't believe in intergalactic slavery, but the Vulcans aren't so picky. They took a prisoner. Oh dear. Normally, the Vulcans would take a captured slave and sell them for a nice profit to Davik, or an off-world slaver. But a Republic officer is no ordinary catch. I still think Bastila is just a Republic officer. That could work to our advantage. Maybe she'll even figure out a way to escape from the Vulcan base on her own. She's mm -hmm. too valuable to leave with the Vulcan scum at the base. Brezik's probably got your Republic friend hidden away somewhere safe until the big swoop race. You'll never find her. Swoop race? Swoop race? I'm afraid your friend has become a pawn in Brezik's game to take over the lower city. He's offered her up as the Vulcan's share of the prize in the annual Swoop Gang race. By putting up such a valuable prize, Brezik hopes to win the loyalty of some of the smaller gangs. Their numbers will allow him to finally destroy me and my followers. So how do you propose we go about rescuing Bastila then? Well, we can't fight all the gangs. The only hope you have of rescuing Bastila is to somehow win the big season opener of the Swoop race. What? What's a Swoop race anyway? Oh, that's a type of bike speeder. I see. I might be able to help you with this. <laughs> if you'd be willing to help us. We both have something to gain here. And much to lose. Okay, sounds like a good deal. Why are you the supposing? The race is for the lower city gangs only. I could sponsor you as a rider for the Hidden Vex this year. If you win the race, you'll win your friend's freedom. But first, you have to do something for me. My mechanics have developed an accelerator for a swoop engine. A bike with mm. the accelerator installed can beat any other swoop out there. But the Vulcans uh -huh. stole the prototype from us. They plan to use it to guarantee a victory in this year's swoop race. I need oh. to break into their base and steal it back. I might put to get inside the Vulcan base. Getting into the Vulcan base won't be easy. The front doors are locked tight. I know someone who might be able to get you in the back way. Mission Veil. Oh? Mission? Uh -huh. Gaddon, you can't be serious. She's just a kid. How is she supposed to help them with this? Mission's explored every step of every back alley in the lower city. Plus, she knows the undercity sewers better than anyone. If anyone can get inside the Vulcan base, it's her. M Mission, what a name. <laughs> she and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always oh, looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the Undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the Undercity. But you'll need some way past the Sith Guard post at the elevator. I've got this uniform to disguise myself. A simple disguise might have worked on the Upper City card. But the security down here is much tougher. You'll oh. need the proper papers to get past him. Luckily, my so gang ambushed oh. one of the Sith patrols headed down to the Undercity. They never made it, and their security papers fell into my hand. Since we're uh -huh. working together now, I suppose I could give them to you in exchange for your uniforms. With the security papers, you won't need a disguise anyway. Okay, fair deal. Good choice. Thanks for the uniforms. You won't need them with these security papers anyway. 